When I began thinking about the exhibition, I took as my guide a poem, a kind of prose poem that Robbins wrote as a very young man in the early 1940s. In it, he talks about my city, my city, my city, and he gives a portrayal of New York City that is full of different sort of um, people, different scenes, and also full of both the aspirations of the city as well as its loneliness and alienation. It's a kind of complete human portrait, it seems to me. And so I took that prose poem as the guide to the structure of the exhibition overall. Different phrases within that poem structure different sections of the exhibition. The first section, My City Lies Between Two Rivers, recognizes that although Robbins was born in Manhattan, he moved at the age of two to Weehawken, New Jersey, which is where he grew up. In Weehawken, he was the son of an immigrant family, a Jewish immigrant, immigrants from the area between Russia and Poland that had been back and forth between those two countries, ruled back and forth between those two countries. Um, and they found success in moving to New Jersey um, being a part of a, uh, running a corset company and sort of being a part of what was common for immigrants in the early 20th century to try to assimilate and try to achieve more than their previous generation had achieved. They put those goals also into their children. Robbins was a, a prolific creative child from the very beginning. He read poems, he wrote poems, he made music, he took dance lessons, following his sister into dance lesson, as was common of boys at the time. He also wrote essays, uh, he took uh, photographs, and he drew and sketched the world around him. He was already trying to figure out who he was by creative outlets and expression.